I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. I'm just going to do a quick feeding video. And uh, I'm just going to go through the snakes and I'm not going to edit it or anything. But first is this girl jungle carpet. And hopefully she eats rats today. She's been she's been wanting to take mice, but there you go. She just took a small rat. Yeah, sometimes with jungles, if you give them mice, then they'll start just taking mice. Which is a little bit of a pain in the ass. This guy always just ate mice. We'll see if he goes for a small rat. Oh yeah. Oh, well, he let it go though. That's really weird. Alright, a mouse. I'll probably come back to him. And here is the jungle diamond. Usually with the carpets I feed them every other week. It's pretty, pretty easy to get them too fat. So usually one good sized meal every two weeks or so it's good to go and then we got the olive python who she is always ready to go should probably get another one of those mice an adult corn snake, a melanistic. This guy's 13 years old. Let's see if he's hungry. There you go. The corn snakes also as adults, I feed them less and less. Maybe every two weeks as well. Here's the pine snake. This is a little bit of a small meal for him, but that's all right. He's a full-grown adult. Usually with the pine snakes, I usually leave it in there because they're a little more timid with the food. Well, he's not being timid right there. All right, time to go on to the next rack. All right, on the top here, we have a Solomon Island ground boa. She is gravid. We will see if she wants to eat. She hasn't been eating that much. They have a really slow metabolism, so you really don't have to feed them that much. But let's see. But these are beautiful snakes. They can have 20 to 50 babies, even people have known them to have as many as 70. So we'll see how she does. She might be a little timid though, if I leave it there maybe she'll eat. I don't really want to torture her, but I would like to get a meal in her. There you go. Yeah, she just bit on it. It's always good. Oh, well, she let go, but we'll see if she eats it. This is a little yearling in Louisiana pine. Let's see if we can get her to get up there. They like to hide under and then when you hit their head strike out. So hopefully I can get her to do that. There you go. And then she goes kind of crazy. She wraps that thing up. 
And here we have a water python. And she's ready to go. She'll get two of these little mice. Next little mouse. Here's the green tree python. Whoa! He's striking all over the place. Usually very picky about eating with the light on. Usually I have to turn the light off. But it is a little dark right now. Took it no problem. And now, we have one more small rat, which is going to go to this female corn snake in Annery. There she goes. I don't know if the... Solomon Island ground bow is going to eat this, but oh boy, nope. So now we have a Mexican black king snake in there. This is a little bit older than that first one, but another Louisiana pine. Here I'm hissing. But it doesn't. And then here's the Mexican black. She seemed really hungry, so. Yeah, she's ready to go. Alright, guys, and that will be it. Thanks for watching. I got a, a few more snakes to feed, but I'll just feed them a second meal. So, everyone's watching me. Alright, thanks for watching, guys.